Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Alicia. I do subscription box unboxings and product reviews every day of the week except for Sundays. Um, if you see or hear my pup, she's up here and she's kind of uh, just walking around and doing her thing. So just in case you see her, she may be in a, a couple of the shots. So today I'm going to be doing some of my clothing boxes. So I just received my Stitch Fix. So with Stitch Fix, um, you get a bundle of clothing in here along with your paperwork and a envelope to send anything back that you do not want, want to keep. You have your own stylist for Stitch Fix, so each time you can go in and do a styling profile and you have your own styles that will work with you. And you can leave messages and different things for your stylist to go in and, and pick different things that you like and things like that. Um, this is $20 for whatever frequency you're going to get it. So right now I'm doing monthly. And if you buy anything in here, in, in your box, you'll get the $20 um, styling fee back. Yes, there's a 25% discount if you buy all of the items that are in your box. And like I said, you get your $20 styling fee back if you purchase even just one item. Okay, so we'll go ahead and get started on it. It looks like... From what I can tell, there's one pair of jeans and four tops in here is what it looks like. Alright, so let's get started. So this is what the bundle looks like once I took it out of the box. So it is put together in paper and this is what everything looks like just so you can get an idea of the colors. So I'm going to go ahead and put on one of the tops along with the jeans. So we'll just keep the jeans on. Now these are the same jeans that I got last time in my first video which I'll post up there for you guys if you want to check it out. But they are one size smaller so we'll see how they work. I kind of asked the stylist if she could maybe send me something that was more on sale but I guess it wasn't on sale. So we'll give them a try and see what we think. Okay, so I've put on the jeans. These are the Silver Jeans Co. Suki Straight Jean. And these are a 16 the last time they sent me um, an 18. So I'll have to turn the camera down. But these do fit me a lot better. But they are, again, still $79. So unless they're, like, amazing, I'm not going to be purchasing those. So this is the Fortune and Ivy Cristel button-down top. Um... And my stylist, by the way, is Casey, and it says this is my third fix. I didn't never um, recorded my first fix, so only the second and then this one. This is the white, obviously, with the black stripes. Um, this is a double XL, and this is $42. So um, this fits really well, but I put in my profile that I don't like stripes. I, I just feel like they never look good on me. You guys let me know what you think about it, but I just feel like stripes don't really look good. So I I love the fit of this. If they had it in like a print or like a plain color, I feel like this would just look so much better. Um, so I'm probably not going to get this, but if I can swap it out for another color, which I think Stitch Fix is um, getting ready to do that to allow you to not only exchange for size but also for color that would be like an awesome option um and also i don't think i mentioned with stitch fix you only have three days to try on and send back so i'm trying to get this videoed um before that has to go back i also have my thread up box here but they give you seven days to try on and return for that so stitch fix you have to be like really quick so anyway um let me know what you guys think about this top it does have the fold sleeves or you could just undo this and leave the sleeve down like that so it's not quite a full sleeve I'll just come a little closer so you guys can kind of check out what it is and I'm not like a huge fan of the fold sleeve only because they never stay folded um, and it's kind of a wide sleeve at the end so I don't know if that I'm a fan of the style and then it's got the two pockets I don't know that I need those but Anyway, that's the shirt. Let me turn down the camera so you guys can see the pants. They they do fit really well. I actually, I have to be honest, these are stretchy and I do like the stretchy, but I didn't even unbutton them to get them on. I just kind of slid them on. So um, They still have a little bit of room here. I do prefer the straight jeans, uh, but this is what they look like. And I think 
you know, they're not bad. They do feel good. They do have a good fit. This is the back. Um, but, you know, $79, I, I mean, I just would think that they would have to be amazing for that. And I don't think that I want to pay $79. So, um, these are the jeans. Let me know what you guys think. And I'm going to turn the camera back up. So, I forgot to show you the back of the shirt, just so you can see what that looks like. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and get into the next shirt then. Okay, so this is the Fortune and Ivy. Again, this is the same exact shirt as the other one I just had on. Um, but this one is called the Rebecca Zipper. No, sorry, that's the wrong one. So, they sent me three Fortune and Ivy shirts. So this one is also the Chris Shell button down in white but with the with the black flower print on it. This one's also $42. So it's the same exact. Now I do like the print on this. You guys let me know what you think. I think the print is very pretty. Um, it says the pockets again and again. I'm not a huge fan of the of the roll up sleeve just because I know they never stay I don't I feel like if you're gonna do that you should like tack them or something but these are also made to wear down but this is a possibility because I do like the print on it but again I think maybe I'd like another color too so if I could swap that other one out maybe for another color but let me know what you guys think about this I think it is pretty let me show you the back again it's the same exact shirt as what I just had on Okay, so let me go ahead and get the next shirt, which is also the same brand, and we'll see what that looks like. Okay, guys, um, so this is the Fortune and Ivy. This is the Rebecca Zipper Detailed something. For some reason, the item names on this sheet are cut off, so it just says Re Rebecca Zipper Detail Navy. These are all um, double XLs, and this one's $40. So I'm going to tell you right now that I absolutely hate this pattern. Um, again, it's the same shirt. It's the roll-up sleeves. It's got, these are faux pockets. Those were actually, on the other ones, were like real pockets, but still. And then, of course, this one has the zipper. I think even if I liked this, this is a little bit low, so might need a little bit of a smaller size. Let me show you the back because it's a different material. It's stretchy. And, of course, it's all navy instead of having a pattern. But I really am not a fan of this pattern. You guys let me know what you think of it. I'll just come a little closer so you can kind of see what the pattern looks like. But I, I really just don't like the pattern at all. You guys let me know what you think about it. I think right now the only shirt that I like is the one that I had on this last time, the white one with the, um, with the flowers on it, the flower print. But we have one more shirt to try on. So let's go ahead and get that one. All right, everybody, I've got the last one on. It's it's a little big. Um, Mixed by 41 Hawthorne is the brand. It's it says it's a Calon brush knit gray. I think um, I think I'm gonna have to go down in size to a 1XL because I feel like a lot of these things are just too big. This is a 2X and it's also $38, which isn't a bad price. So I don't mind these I think you know that's fine and I am working from home so I can pretty much wear whatever I want to wear um, I do walk my dog many many times a day so I'm not going to be in my pajamas or anything but this is a nice shirt I don't I don't mind it I think I would need to go down a size if you can see the sleeves are really long so I mean I just rolled them up quick just so you could you know kind of see that and then the detail on there, they have like kind of a little stripe, which is fine. This is super duper soft. Let me just show you the back. And this is a stretchy shirt as well. And I just move further away so you can kind of see how it goes around the bottom here, which I do like. And I like the little pocket, but I think that it's a little big. Because um, if I didn't pull this up, like, you know, if I wasn't wearing it, if I wore a shirt under here, it would be okay, but I'm not wearing a shirt under here, so I feel like, you know, there's too much happening here, and um, it should be up a little bit further. If I let it all the way down, it would kind of be, it would be too big, so I think that we need to go down a size. I think I will go down a size for the next box and see, 
you know if that fits better on this one let me know what you guys think of this I I do like it I don't mind um, that these are like white or whatever because we have like the white detail here as well but this is really cute just a little knock around and stuff like that I'll move a little closer so you guys can kind of see it's got like gray and and black and some different colors in there which is really cool so let me know what you guys thought of all of the different um, shirts and the jeans I think right now I'm looking at one of the tops the white one with the black print and then possibly sizing down on this and if I could exchange one of the other tops since they were all the same brand basically for maybe another color that they might have I might do that because I did like the way those fit I just am not crazy about those sleeves but you know it is a pretty top but let me know what you guys think about it so that was my stitch fix for this month um, leave your comments below I'd love to hear them and I'd love a thumbs up if you like the video and if you subscribe already, thank you. And if you don't, I'd love it for you to subscribe for future videos. And keep your eye out for my thread up because I will be um, recording that video as well. Thanks for spending some time with me.